Welcome back. It's time for a Music Makers segment, and today we're featuring music by Serge Bambara, best known by his stage name, Smokey. Here to tell us more about Smokey and his music is viewers RM Music uh, Radio Show, ho uh, show host Roger Munto. Roger, it's uh, very good to see you again. It's been good a while. Good to see you too, Vance. It's yeah. been a while. That's You've right. been traveling, so man. I've been traveling. Yeah, we're happy to have you Bringing back. Bringing you some more material. Exactly. <laughs> and you went to West Africa, came back with this good stuff. Uh, and this music mm. uh, by Serge Smokey mm. is very special because this guy is not just an entertainer. Mm. Tell, tell me just a little bit about yeah, him. Yeah, he, he's not just an entertainer. He's, uh, he's a rapper. He's well known all over Burkina Faso yeah. because he, he is a, a, a conscience rapper. He yeah. talks about things that affect uh, his country. He's a, a rev revolutionary, if yeah. I should say that way. Uh, he rap about uh, things that doesn't go well with the government. He is one of the uh, Ballet Citoyen, which is a movement uh -huh. that actually uh, helped uh, ousted uh, uh, President Blaise oh, Compaoré sure. from wow, the that was that's right. big. Yes, yeah. very big, very yeah. big. So yeah. the song we're going to feature here, yeah. I couldn't pronounce it so well. Yeah, it is Tombe Le Lim. Tombe Le yes. Lim. Yeah. And this is, uh, I think it's featuring, talking about something to do with the FGM. Uh, exactly, with the FGM. Exactly. Society. That's correct. Yeah, so let, let's watch this let's and watch see uh, what uh, we can get out of it. Let's watch this. This is really a, a song with a powerful mm. message. So Tombella Lim means throw away the razor. Throw away the, 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 throw away the, the razor, stop with that. And, yeah. and you know, Vince, this is one of the issues that you have to be really careful that you can't just talk about it like this. It's people's culture. Right, exactly, yeah. because of the culture and stuff. So he feels really uh, uh, obligated. That's why he told me, I met with him in Ouagadougou while yeah. I was there, I had a show with him. He told me he feels really powerful talking about subject yeah. that nobody else will, yeah. will discuss. But, but you know, it's it's a it's a it's nice that he can talk about it because a person like this gets to reach the audiences exactly. in, in a very special way. He, he does. Mitchell, in, in a very special way. Matter of fact, yeah. when I was there, he was telling me that his life is always in danger. Mm -hmm. Him leaving, even to come and meet with me in the studio, he was yeah. really afraid, and he didn't. He thinks that people actually follow and you know to know where he was going and yeah. follow everything that he does. Uh -huh. in, and in terms of uh, his um, music, how big is he? Not only in his country, but uh, outside oh, of his country, he is, he is huge. Yeah. Not just in his country, but all over Africa. Because again, he is part of the Bali Citoyen, which is a movement that talks about things that doesn't go well in his country with the government, with everything. But he also influenced other people in the DRC, in Senegal. He became friends with other movements like the Filimbi, mm -hmm. the La Lucha, which is the same movement of young people in the DRC mm -hmm. and other places in Senegal. And uh, is there much, uh, anything you can also tell us about who else we may have to feature here that you met in West Africa during your travels? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Another one is called uh, Frère Malcolm. Mm -hmm. Frère Malcolm is another powerful uh, artist that I met there. Maybe next time we'll get to talk about him. But he kind of has the same path than uh, Smokey. Yes, and then you, you brought me that beautiful interview by um, Alpha. Alpha Blondie. Right. Will we get to play some of his music? Because oh, yeah, yeah, we didn't we get, get to play, an opportunity yeah, to play he that. He gave me a lot yeah. of it. Yeah. And you can imagine me, I was thinking about you, yeah. when I met with Alpha Blondie. The first thing <laughs> that came to my head was like, because yeah. we talked about it yeah. a few times. It's one yeah. of my 
Favorite, I right. mean, all exactly. the time. So yeah. he gave me a lot of music yeah. to come and play, and he talks a lot about VOA. Yeah. He talked about VOA. See, I that listened a, to VOA since I was a kid. Good shout out. Yeah, yeah, since he was, was a kid, and now yeah, and now he's meeting with his little guy, yeah. Roger Mintz. And the thing I liked about him also is like he says, he acknowledges, he has changed the message. Exactly. He's yeah. learned. You heard about, about that in an interview. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, and I was really shocked, uh, mm -hmm. Vince. As you know, this guy was a, you oh, know, an alpha blondie guy. He was direct. And now he's changing his message to love and peace. No. Calm down, guys. Let's sit down and... Not and, militants. Uh, no militants Not anymore. Rebel it's changing. You say, Roger, with no. age, things change. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Roger. Thank you, As man. always, man. I appreciate always it. Always good to have you in the studio with us. Thank you so much. Thanks for having yeah, me. That's, um, I want to thank uh, Roger Munto for another really fantastic Music Makers segment. Now, to learn more about Roger Munto and his VOA radio show, visit Facebook and type in the keywords Roger Munto uh, VOA, uh, dot VOA. And you can see what time his program can be heard in your area and get more information about some of his featured artists. And that's our show for today. Uh, be sure to watch Africa 54 on our website at voaafrica.com. Have a good night.